Good morning, my name is Andrew Adams from Parker Adams Boat Sales and we're here today down on the Hamble River. We're at our offices at Hamble Point where we've been hosting the Cobra Ribs Demo Weekend. Now it's Monday, we don't have any appointments booked in for today, it was all on Friday, Saturday and Sunday. Um, we are left, however, with these stunning Cobras. Now sadly Cobra aren't leaving this, these all for us to play with, um, but what I wanted to do today was just focus in on the 9.2. Um, I've done a walkthrough video on most of the Cobras in the range um, but the 9.2 is one that I haven't actually done a review on. Um, I went out on this boat yesterday and I've driven this boat quite a lot but I, I went out yesterday um, and did several demos out in, in the Solent um, and I think the only way to describe the performance of this rib is brutal. Um, it is effortless, it's smooth, it's powerful but it's brutal. And what I wanted to do today was just give a run through tour of the rib, show the features, show the benefits, um, but you can't ignore the fact that nestling on the back here are twin 300 horsepower Mercury V8 um, Verado engines. Um, they are just so smooth, so effortless, and so powerful. Um, going out on the um, sea trials yesterday, what, what's really breathtaking about these ribs is when you, you're traveling along at about 40 knots and you put the throttle down and it almost knocks you off your feet. Um, the performance is just so amazing from these engines. Um, so let's start at the back um, and run through. So as I've mentioned, this, in, this particular boat is a 9.2 metre Cobra Nautique um, and it's fitted with these twin Mercury 300 V8 engines. They're so smooth, so effortless, um, but they do have a noise button. In fact, they've got a button that's built into the dash that you can just press and it says sports exhaust and then you get a proper V8 thrud to them. Um, but starting at the back, you can see the um, the teak steps here as you get onto the boat, um, beautifully finished, beautifully um, presented. You've got the ski pole here, you've got a ski hook up there, and then your navigation lights, um, your VHF aerial. Um, this boat is fitted with lots and lots of extras, one of which is a transom shower, and you can see a stainless steel covering there um, on the transom shower. And then of course there's big stainless steel uh, tie bar tying these two powerful beastie engines together. Um, Cobra have put a couple of lovely little touches on this boat. The, um, the Cobra logo is inset here. Um, uh, that's to match the same colour as the wine upholstery. That's a Silvertex wine upholstery. Um, you can see they can customise these. And next door here, we've got the twisted Cobra. And you can see the twisted logo just in there. But on the 9.2, it's all cut in here. This is fitted out with grey mouldings. Um, and they've also got these new um, grab handles. These are new um, for 2020 models. And these are really, really useful when you're sat around in this U-shaped seating, which is just the most brilliant social space here. Um, these, cut, these handles, when you're going along, do provide that, that great level of comfort um, and ability just to sit and enjoy the ride. Um, underneath here, you've got flush fit fusion speakers. So they're just beautifully nestled in there you can barely notice them and then you've got the drain plugs um, for the self-draining cockpit um, and then you've got these um, super yacht style um, led lights all stainless steel clad and then of course these teak steps here um, you might have noticed these really popular option at the moment is the, the multi-teak. Um, this is an option from Cobra, which nearly every boat is going out with at the moment. And in fact, we've got um, four Nautiques lined up in a row here. We've got the 9-2, an 8-7, another 8-7, and our 7-7 over in the background. Every single one of these has actually got this multi-teak effect, which really does look stunning. So... In terms of practicalities, this table here, um, it folds away. So you've got the ability to have a lovely dining area here uh, with your friends and your family, or you just fold this up here, that collects there, lift this up, and then just store the table away in this locker, close it down again, and the table's gone. And now you've got a really practical um, space here for people to stand um, and enjoy. Um, at the back on this particular boat, on the 92, you have the option of this lovely big deep locker. So this has got a, um, a sun pad cushion on the top of it as well, or you can open it up and you can see here loads and loads of space. One of our customers used one of these boats last year to go down for a holiday down to the West Country. Um, they loaded this cupboard up uh, with all of their, um, their food, loaded it up with all of their baggage, and then stayed in Airbnbs when they were down in Devon, which is a great way of doing it. You can see everything is beautifully trunked. The attention to detail, the quality on the Cobra build is really evident, and even the parts that you can't see. Let's close that up again. Water tank access is just on the top there that fills that up for the shower. 
um, and then you've also got um, one of the fuel tank accesses just there. So let's turn around and have a look at the, the helm position. So this particular boat is fitted with a single um, pod. So you can fit these boats out with twins of these. Um, but this has got the single one and you've got locker space here at the top. Um, inside this locker um, is fitted out with a USB socket um, and a cigarette socket. Another small locker just underneath. And then a big storage locker just down here and this boat hasn't got it but there is the option to refrigerate this whole unit here so this becomes a refrigerated locker as well so a running cool box if you look at the dash the dash is beautiful this is the new cobra halo dash so you've got these lovely stainless steel inserts here and um, the push buttons they all illuminate at night and then you've got the mercury um, vessel view control and then a garmin plotter here garmin vhf and of course these beautiful mercury control units here um, built in here you also have a anchor um, windlass so the controls for the windlass are here and that also doubles up as a chain counter so you've got really vers versatile access to the anchor winch which is built through the hull of course your very important kill cord there perfect position to go around the leg and then more speakers here again flush fit speakers and the nautique sign here beautifully inlaid for those of you that don't know, these Cobra seats are actually suspension seats. They may not look it because they're not big, fat and ugly seats, but actually they're all suspension. You've got the bolster, which sits up here. Pull the bolster down, sit in the seat, and obviously you can't experience it on the film, but there's normally about, about two inches of travel on there. So it's not a huge drop, but certainly when you're, you're blasting along at sea, um, these seats are working really, really hard behind you, and all the mechanism for this is accessed just through here access through to the mechanism in there and then obviously the gas struts are built into here but access through the seat so let's keep working our way forward um, this is fitted with a heads console so this console here although it looks quite small and compact actually is small and compact but what it hides in here just open up this locker here lift that up and in there you have a heads compartment so just bring this into here um, you've got a stainless steel sink you've got toilet roll holder you've got electric toilet um, you've got the toilet down here um, access to seacocks all beautifully laid to teak um, and everything that you need is in here not the largest um, unit but for those that need to have a loo at sea you've got everything you need in there let's close that back down again that's all obviously on a gas strut and then just clip it shut again for the suicide seat, you've got really, really nice stainless steel handles. So when you sat down here, you're going along, you've got a great place to hold on. Um, and you can see just here into camera view, the teak steps. So when you're getting onto the rib, ribs, the decks are obviously quite a long way down, but Cobra have thought about that. And on the whole Nautique range, you have these steps here to step into, and then also here. So it makes stepping onto the rib very, very easy and straight inside. Now this area here, create the, the very custom um, Cobra. Cobra the first company to make this big U-shaped seating in the front of ribs. All the other manufacturers have copied them now, um, but it's still, it's beautiful having the Bentley stitch on this, the diamond stitching. And then you can see here three um, loops. So you have a th segmented into three section sun pad. And if I open this one here, actually no, that's the fenders. <laughs> open this one here. You can see that they just store in this locker here. So the reason they do it in three is so that it's easy to store. So everything really nicely thought out. Anchor um, locker is just at the bow. You just lift this seat up here, pull that forward, and you can see you've got anchor controls here, windless controls you've got to keep on there as well. Close that up. And just to see what that looks like from the outside, we walk around here. You can see this lovely stainless steel anchor here nestling in there. Other things that Cobra do this year is they've got this custom stripe that can be added to the boat to match up with the, um, the stripe here to be matched up with the upholstery. So this stripe here is in wine, uh, which fits really, really beautifully. And you can see this boat is a beast. So just to talk to you again about the performance of it, um, out on sea trials yesterday, um, we had around about 60 knots with about four people on it. So this boat's good for about 63, 64 knots. But the amazing thing about the Cobra 9.2 is just how effortlessly it delivers it. Um, 
it, at 60 knots, you feel, you, you wouldn't do it, but you feel like you could let go of the steering wheel and it would just handle, be completely controlled. At no point does it feel out of control, dangerous, sketchy. They just track. These hulls really are an absolute triumph for Cobra. Um, they're such a deep V, um, huge performance. You just see a, one of our customers coming in here. Give Tristram a little wave to the camera. Um, Tristram's bringing this Cobra 9 meter, one of the older Nautiques, in for us to broker. So this has been the walkthrough tour on the Cobra 9.2. So as I said, this Cobra 9.2 is fitted with twin Mercury 300s. The performance on it is absolutely amazing. The attention to detail throughout the boat, as you'd expect from Cobra, is second to none. So if you want to have a view of this boat, um, please get in touch with us at Parker Adams Boat Sales. We'd be delighted uh, to talk you through the boat, put together a quote, um, and arrange for you to have what is an absolute dream of a Cobra machine. So thanks so much for watching. Once again, Again, thank you um, for watching our videos please like subscribe to our channel and we look forward to seeing you again very very soon many thanks